Hello everyone, in this video let us talk about uh, the best way to learn Grav. In case you are wondering how can you learn Grav uh, very quickly, I highly recommend you to take a look at uh, nothing but the Grav official documentation and this official documentation can be found if you go to the Grav website, getgrav.org. If you go to this page, go to this website, you can take a look at, of course, uh, uh, this uh, link where you can uh, download Grav. But uh, there is also this link on top called uh, Learn. If you click on this Learn link, you will be taken to this uh, documentation. And uh, in my opinion, this is uh, one of the most uh, simplest and uh, easy to follow documentation that I have come across uh, recently. If you start from uh, this uh, navigation on the left hand side, just try to follow, of course, uh, this uh, navigation on the left uh, from the very beginning. You can start with uh, what is Grav. Here you can understand uh, the fundamentals of Grav. You can take a look at uh, different, uh, uh, different things that uh, Grav relies on. Things like uh, tweak templating, Markdown, uh, YAML configuration files, and uh, these are some links that will probably take you to the other websites. But uh, the moment you start following this uh, uh, section on the left hand side, this navigation, you can start by simply following this uh, easy to follow documentation. You can, of course, take a look at the requirements in case you are wondering uh, whether Grav is suitable or uh, maybe you need a specific set of, set of configurations for your uh, site. You can, of course, uh, learn these things here. But uh, just follow the documentation uh, as it is. You can uh, first try to install Grav on your, uh, on your computer, for example. By installing, I just mean simply downloading the Grav uh, uh, package, unzip it, and you have a site up and running. You just need to configure it. So there is no installation as such apart from just uh, downloading the uh, Grav uh, package from the website. You can of course uh, follow the documentation just to understand uh, if uh, there is a specific configuration that is required to make your Grav site uh, probably a bit more uh, faster. So you can follow this documentation and I highly recommend you that in case you're serious about uh, building, a gra building a website using Grav, in case uh, after the initial evaluation of Grav, you can of course uh, just uh, download it and start looking at the Grav site uh, within five minutes. But of course, uh, after the evaluation, you may want to build a proper site. And in that case, it makes a lot of sense to read the documentation uh, at least once. It won't take long time. It will probably take a couple of hours. But uh, if you just want to follow it uh, and uh, perform these things step by step, you will probably need maybe half a day, maybe full day, depending upon how deep you want to go. But just follow the uh, basic tutorial, uh, which is of course the fourth link if you look at the navigation. But uh, if you look at the uh, basic tutorial, you will probably learn uh, a lot about how pages are added, how these uh, numbers or these uh, uh, numbers that you have in front of the folder name of your specific uh, page or section uh, will help you in organizing your content. So just follow this this documentation, understand how a different type of uh, uh, things that you can do with Grav, like adding a page or maybe adding a, a modular type of uh, content. And after you're finished with, finished with uh, reading this uh, documentation, you will get a very good idea about building a website using uh, Grav. But in case you are stuck somewhere, in case you are probably uh, wondering uh, what if you have any questions, what if you need uh, to probably uh, uh, understand or do some troubleshooting if you are stuck somewhere. So there is also a community. If you go to this link called uh, grav, uh, getgrav.org slash forum, you will find uh, other people who are using Grav, who like using or working on Grav. They will ask uh, questions and uh, you will probably find other people also helping each other. So once you are uh, probably ready with uh, your actual uh, development with Grav, I'm sure you will have a lot of questions and sometimes uh, you might not find those things uh, very easily in your documentation. Although this documentation explains 
a lot but still if you are looking for quick answers you can do a quick search on uh, the uh, graph community website so this is something that i wanted to uh, talk about today how you can also uh, get started on graph if you are serious about building a website maybe for your client or maybe for yourself and uh, you think that uh, uh, you need to probably learn it so go ahead and uh, start uh, using the official documentation uh, by going to learn.getgraph.org so i hope this video was useful thank you very much